Bali is already a holiday hotspot for Aussies, but now it's targeting a new type of tourist. Forget sun, fun and cheap drinks, the Indonesian government is investing big money to make Bali the go-to place for plastic surgery. If I could get a tummy tuck here, I would definitely have it done. I wouldn't even get a tattoo here. I think it's a great idea. From eat, love, pray to eat, love and plastic surgery. Can Bali follow through on a bold bid to become Australia's number one medical tourism destination? Lips, eye, breasts, all the procedure of plastic surgery. Anything you want? Anything you want. During the COVID lockdown, Bali's near total dependency on tourism was laid bare. During pandemic, we have a scar. Perhaps all the talk about scars led officials to come up with a radical post-pandemic tourism strategy. So there talk to will me. be a really beautiful building. A beautiful building here, yeah? Ramp up cosmetic and plastic surgery procedures for Aussie holiday makers right here in a purpose-built aesthetic wellness and anti-aging centre. One-stop shopping. Dr Eck is a dermatologist. She's given me a tour of Bali Sangla Hospital, where the new centre will be built. Soon, this car park will be transformed into six floors of specialist care, including a penthouse for plastic surgery, supposedly better than anything on offer in Singapore or Thailand. <laughs> well, cheaper than Australia. A lot more cheaper more than Australia, than Australia. yes. This is Dr Roy. He's one of Bali's premier plastic surgeons and a familiar, friendly face to some 200 Aussies yeah. who have previously experienced his help. handiwork. Yes. Yeah. We want uh, our patient a, a aging beat beautifully, right? Yes. Okay. Healthy from inside and Healthy outside. Inside, outside. <laughs> Yes, that's my vision. Yes. yes. But you're particularly good at helping the outside. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Bali already offers cosmetic and plastic surgery procedures. But the Indonesian government's set aside a bucket of money to bring the current trickle of operations into the mainstream. From Botox to boob jobs and bum lifts. I come from a medical background and unless they are going to start their hospitals with... <laughs> our trained staff. Yeah, they had something like that here, it'd be great. And if they can bring it up to the level that is more acceptable and it's got to be good. <laughs> they think that water cleans everything here. Our perky implants? Oh, I can't wait. <laughs> nah, not for me, not for me, maybe for others, but nah. If you have a look at my face, I could do with a few lifts anyway, so... <laughs> You know, what, what more can I say? I think, no, for the people here, I think it would be a great idea. So where would you draw the line? Teeth whitening. <laughs> Nothing injectable. The only injection Bali Tourism Board Chairman Ida Bagasadnyane is concerned with is one involving cash. This uh, pandemic impact to the Bali tourism and economic in Bali very bad, so... So we have uh, 34 province uh, in Indonesia. We are the lowest. In the year before the pandemic, Bali welcomed more than five and a half million visitors. Last year, just 50 tourists turned up. Now, even with COVID travel restrictions lifted, holiday tourists have been slow to return, highlighting the need to diversify and capture a slice of the huge medical tourism market. It's good for domestic market. The foreigners will come for the for the medical. Yeah. So this is very important. Another uh, market segment will be come to Bali. The if you build it, they will come approach is already happening. The Indonesian government is partnering with US disease research and treatment leader Mayo Clinic to open a cancer hospital in Bali. And when it comes to plastic surgery, the Koreans have the inside running. We will try to build a collaboration to the other center. The first center is from Korea. So we will still in progress to do the collaboration. 
a special economic zone has been earmarked for Bali that could see foreign medical professionals, including Australian doctors and nurses, allowed to work here. You will live a long time. It might not fit the famous movie's holistic healing theme, but there'll still be more to Bali than chasing those movie star looks. Mind, soul and body. Yes, mind, soul and body.